Yo, what up? It's Dill, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up a MetaMask wallet and connect to Rarible. So the first thing you want to do is download MetaMask. Now, you want to make sure you don't get this off a scam website. One thing that's common is you might see a Google ad right here that brings you to a fake MetaMask website. You want to watch out for those things in crypto. Just make sure that you're on this website, MetaMask.io, and then go ahead and download it here. You'll go ahead and download it for Chrome and install it in your browser. Now, you do need Google Chrome, or I believe it works with Firefox. Here are the supported browsers. You can see there's a few. Uh, Chrome and Firefox are recommended. Brave is a crypto browser that's very cool as well, so you can check that out. But I would recommend you use Chrome, and once you install it, it'll come up here. Now, when you first install it, you'll have the option to set up a wallet. It's going to be very important that you set up your wallet and then actually back up your private key as well. So you'll be able to view your private key uh, in here. You can go into your account details and actually get the info. If you click export private key, you'll be able to save that info. Now what saving the private key does is it lets you load up your MetaMask wallet on any computer or any Ethereum wallet for that matter. So it's very useful and very important to save your private key. If you lose access to this wallet, in order to recover your Ethereum, you'll have to put in that private key. So you want to save it on a piece of paper, print it out, and store it in something very secure, like a safe or a lockbox. So definitely take care of your private key. And once you have MetaMask Wallet configured, you'll see this kind of screen. I have another video on how to use the MetaMask Wallet, but basic information, you can copy the address here, which is very important for sending and receiving. Now, this video is just about how to connect the MetaMask Wallet to Rarible, so we're just going to focus on that simple step. First, I'm going to go to rarible.com. Just like when you're navigating to MetaMask, make sure you don't go to the wrong address. It's important you go directly to rarible.com. When you get here, you'll see the home page. I love the view on Rarible. It's very fun, uh, motivating for sellers, you know, putting these top charts right here. Anyway, it's simple to connect with the Web 3.0 wallet. MetaMask is part of Web 3.0, which is built on Ethereum. And this means you can connect your wallet here and your wallet essentially acts as your new username and password. So there's no username and password required. You just connect your wallet and it automatically signs in. And so you can see here, my account is automatically loaded up. I can go to view my items on my profile and everything's there. There was no signing in with username and password because your wallet on MetaMask essentially acts as your new username and password. And so when you import that private key, you're also importing your login for Rarible, OpenSea, or any of the other sites. So very short and simple video, how to use MetaMask Wallet and connect to Rarible. Uh, you should be connected to Rarible pretty simply after this. And if you want a more in-depth video about how to use the MetaMask Wallet, just look up how to use MetaMask Dill NFT, or just look at the other videos on my channel. I hope this helped you get started on Rarible. And if you enjoyed, drop a like and a comment and make sure you check out my other videos. Subscribe to the Crypto Boy YouTube channel. It's Dill and I'm out.